The vision of restoring connectivity throughout the watershed sounded amazing, daunting, but possibly achievable. The Elwive is a sea run fish. The Passamaquoddy people call them the fish that feed all. For thousands of years, these rivers were a focal point for travel, as a source of food. It was astronomical. It was of huge run of Elwives. The history of alewife and the Bagadoos is really analogous to what they've gone through in the whole state of Maine and arguably the Atlantic coast. Some people think that, oh, the beavers leave a little hole for the fish to go through. No, they don't. There's no little hole. 30 years ago, it was easy to get lobster bait. It's not easy anymore. It's local organic. How can you beat it? And the alewife's an example of a keystone species that when you yank that out of the arch, the rest of it collapses. What's unique about Maine is there are communities with people that still have a memory of what these fish runs could be like. There's a system set up to include those fishermen and those community members in the management. This is people's food, this is people's livelihood, and we need to do something to make it right. You remove a dam, or you put in a fishway, or you fix a culvert, the alewives respond. Partnerships are critical to this effort. No one entity could do this alone. As this is really, truly a watershed scale effort, which is really means that the benefits we get out of it are going to be sustainable into the future. The whole project just kind of grew exponentially overnight and blossomed into what we have now, which is a complete restoration of all the ponds on the Bagadoos River.